Today, I'm going to be trying to make a beat without the use of VST generators. And what that means is no Omnisphere, no Analog Lab 5, no Contact. Probably mostly going to be using one shots. Yeah, let's just make a start. Let's go. Obviously, no VSTs allowed apart from mixing VSTs. So I'm going to need some one shots. So let's just see what we can find. All right, first sound done. All right, next sound. I think we have the three elements or four elements that we need, so we're going to start adding some accents. Sounds pretty good. Now going to throw all the accents into the mixer track as well with the bass and mix it all up and then flip it. I mean it already sounds pretty good so let's see what happens when we reverse it. Let's open Fruity Slicer. It's pretty good. Okay, that sounds pretty good. I like that. I like that.
mix all the drums together with the melody and we should be good. I like that one, really easy. Problem is with this one though, sample was a bit too atmospheric. It was really difficult to extract like a really memorable top line melody from that sample, but that one's decent. Let's just move on to the next one. All right, this needs some effects. Bro, okay. Okay. All right, needs a baseline now, I think. All right, I think now I'm going to add some accents again. We're now going to reverse it and see what it sounds like. What I'm going to do once again is throw this into Fruity Slicer. I'm going to increase it by like 300 cents again. I'm going to stretch it out a bit, 120. I'm going to increase the attack and just see what I can come up with. Bro. Let's mix the drums. I'm 
gonna add some half time to the verse, I think. Alright, I think the beat's done. Once again, pretty simple, just some sample chops of a uh, drum, all done without any VST generators. Just goes to show, this was the case five or six years ago as well, but you really do not need Omnisphere, you don't need Analog Lab 5, you don't need a million contact banks, okay? You don't need to spend thousands of dollars on plugins anymore. Invest in a couple of decent accent and one-shot kits and you're good to go. Like, I personally recommend Prod by Jack's Chroma kit, which I didn't use in this video, but is pretty good. Anything by Prod by Lone is pretty good as well. Cody as well has got some pretty good ones. I had fun, because Normally I just spam Analog Lab 5 in, in all of my beats, so it was a good change of pace for me. Hopefully this video helped in some way. And feel free to like the video and subscribe and all that. Let me know whatever genres or artists you want me to cover. Just let me know. Leave a comment below. Let's just listen to the beat and see what I could have done better for next time. <laughs> 